Yankees manager Joe Girardi Paul J. Barris Will Joe Girardi can be high-strung. Joe Girardi can be controlling. He can have a quick hook as Dallin Bettences has learned, but the Joe Girardi the Yankees have seen this season is a much different manager than in the past. Girardi has let the Yankees play. He has stayed out of the way and has let them have fun. He's loosened up a bit, and as a result these Yankees are a blast to watch. They lead the majors in smiles. Thumbs down is their thing. The clubhouse is looser, and Girardi has allowed personalities to emerge. He has shown tremendous patience with young Yankees such as Aaron Judge and Gary Sanchez. He has let them grow and has learned to look past their mistakes. He is focused on their success. In his 10th season as Yankees manager, he has fostered a winning environment where young players can shine, and for all that he deserves more credit than he has been given. The binder has loosened up a bit this season, and as a result, the Yankees head into Tuesday night's a wild card game against the Twins a confident, fun-loving group that is exciting to watch, a team that has brought a buzz back to Yankee Stadium. When I ask Girardi, what is the best thing he can do to prepare the Yankees for this must-win game Tuesday night at Yankee Stadium, his answer did not come out of his binder. That is progress too. I really think giving the guys an atmosphere that's the same as playing a normal game, that's somewhat of a big game during the course of the season, Girardi said. I want our guys loose. I want our guys to have fun. I want our guys energetic. I want them aggressive. To me, it's being the same person that I am every day. In other words, don't tighten up. If Girardi tightens up, his young players will see that, and they might be too tight for such a monster game. One key mistake can lead to another. Elimination games are what it's all about. That's when players have to bring their best game to the field. If a mistake is made, move on quickly. Understand what got you here will win the game against an inferior opponent. Stay the course, and with Luis Severino starting and Girardi having nine other pitchers at his disposal, use the bullpen wisely. The young players need to produce and have fun doing it. This is about today, but it's also about the future and Girardi has earned a new contract. One postseason can be a tremendous learning experience for young players, so much more than games in regular season and Girardi is aware of all that. I think they've come a long way, he said of his baby bombers. I feel really good about them and the way they have played all year. Girardi wears number 28. That is a constant reminder to his players that these Yankees are in search of tomorrow. They are in search of their 28th World Series title. This is only the first step, but it's a big step. Having been around these Yankees since spring training, you know that they have believed all this is possible. They look around and see the talent in the room and smile. Veterans Brett Gardner Tad Frazier and C.C. Sabathia have taken over the leadership role in the clubhouse this season. They provide a valuable service to Girardi. With such accountable young stars as Judge, Severino and even Sanchez, despite some of his defensive woes, this is team focused on the bigger picture. Judge said he has never been around a team where the players care so much for each other and where winning is the focus. That has been the feeling in Yankee Stadium all year, where the Yankees' 51-30 record is the best home record in the AL. Only the Dodgers' 57 wins and the Diamondbacks' 52 wins have won more games at home this season. One more win will come if Girardi once again lets these Yankees play their game.